someone in this your condition? Do you know why? I said the wife is coming. Are you the one? I am the wife. Why do you have to chain my husband like a common criminal? Eh, eh. He is bedridden. He cannot run. So please unchain him. The orders were given for me to chain him, madam. Orders oh, what? From who? Orders from the top. Eh. Yes. I'm very sure that your guy at the top has a wife. Now, and I don't know what he will do. He will not carry his police gun and shoot at anybody that goes close to his wife. On, on tell you know. Madam, all this thing you are saying is not in the law. What? what law? Law? Give me. Oh, 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 for your husband and you need to make some cash deposit. Hmm. How much? Don't worry, when you get to the office you'll find them. Follow me please. Are you serious? They're telling me. <laughs> See, Bayern Munich, eh? Yeah. They will deal with those guys. Why they will? Ah. Um, this guy and a woman, I know they watch both. Ah, Sawo! used to be part of you uh, but but he's sick now so he cannot come so i, I learned how to write this uh, keke i have come here to work with it just as my husband used to so uh, if there's any help you can render by you know pushing customers my way you'll be very appreciated thank you very much 
Ndewo no. We don't need a woman among us. Yes. That is strange. Uh. She wants to sit here and listen to our talk. We will talk about the police and the vagina and the stories of adventure. <laughs> she will say we are not here. No, no. Uh, uh. Mba, yeah. please go home. Go! go. You are go even home. the one who caused them to shoot Nande. Yes. Yes. Who was one of us? Yes. Perhaps you've come to cause more problems, huh? It won't work for you. How will you be driving the KK? Oh. Yeah. Now tell me. Spreading your legs? Oh. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. How does a woman ride you? By closing her legs or spreading them? See, Titus was right. You're already causing trouble for us. It seems you cause trouble everywhere you go to. You have Lucifer hiding inside of you. Not so. How can you say that? I don't have any Lucifer hiding inside of me. Nandi, it's my cousin your husband shot. Hey! Now go home! Hey! I see you! 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 Listen! You don't treat women with hatred! You treat them with care! That's all! Hey, she wants to walk with us! Let's talk! Let's talk! Let's talk! You can walk in police! Are you tomorrow? Thank you for fighting for me. But really, you did not need to. <laughs> no! <laughs> he deserved what he got. I am a Joko. So you've not heard about me? They respect and fear me a lot. So let me hear your problem. I need money. I need to pay my husband's hospital bills. My husband has been sick. I need to pay his hospital bills, take care of myself, and then uh, send money to Ikodia, my husband's sister who has been in secondary school for the past 10 years. God forbid. So that, that story is true. I heard about a girl called Ikodia who's been in secondary school classes for five years. That is she, oh, hmm. mm. my husband's sister. You know what? Bring her out of school and take her to a husband's house. <laughs> Yes. It won't happen. Mm -mm. My husband insists she must be educated. He loves her so dearly. He's the only brother and sister that he has. Even when all we hear are rumors of how she doesn't stay in the boarding house, how she goes, follows men from uh, Onicha to Lagos, from Ihiala to Aba. He still insists that she must finish her uh, secondary school and then go to the university and become a big woman of her own. You see, so I, I really do need money. Eh? Okay. That's why I came out this morning to hustle with the men so I can take care of my problems. Say pity. Say pity. Um, excuse me. Take. Uh, that will help out in your situation. Eh? Oh my God! You give me so much. Eh? Why, why do you give me so much? I say I don't. I don't want to look like I'm begging, and I don't want to be dependent. I. I... Can this be okay? That's what I want to hear. Can I be okay? 
Yes. Good. Yes, so what are we talking about? Yes, we will. Uh -huh. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> May God who sees in light and darkness shower you with blessings Amen. upon blessings. Amen. Amen. So, uh, let's go to my house so you can cook for me. You can even take some of the food to your husband and help it all. Oh? Come, come. Let's go. Oh. I, no, I, you're not following me? No, I, I can't cook for you now. It's not appropriate. <laughs> what is wrong in doing something for somebody who is helping you? Eh? I can't cook for you now. It's not right. I, I said, cook for me. I didn't say sleep in my bed. You know what? I take take your money, please. What? What? Why? Is it what you want? Yeah, now, so that I can think about it. Also, discuss it with my husband. If he says it's okay for me to cook for you, then I can cook for you. Eh? Okay. Wait, wait. Are you not married? No, tell me, oh, because I don't know anything about you. <laughs> what, what would your wife be doing when I'm cooking for you? Okay, can I come to your house and eat? Eh? If my husband, I, I, I need to discuss it with my husband first. Take your money. Okay. All right. Then. <laughs> Look at you. Take the money. Put pride aside. When somebody is helping you, be good to that somebody. No need to scream. She's just been helpful. Eh, Kosovo, Kosovo, stay away from this. Eh? This does not concern you at all. Your duty here is to guard a chain man, and you're doing it very well. I did not go to beg anyone for money. I only went to work, and I got a favor from someone. You don't have to throw everything that I bought, all the food I made for you. You didn't have to throw it away. Oh, you used the money another man gave to you to buy food for me. And you expect me to eat it. Now listen to me, my dear wife. No man gives a woman anything for free. Eh? Is that he wants it now? Or that he's too busy with other women? Or with business? But will certainly want it later. And I will say no. Will you force me? So why did you say no? Why did you not send not to the favor? Look, that is why it is called a favor. A favor is a favor, John. Oh God, John, this is your sickness and this your condition. He's really turning you into the most difficult man I've ever seen. Oh, uh, uh, hold on. You now say I have condition because I'm sick. Eh? Mm -mm, please don't say that. That's not what I meant. But you said that. You said I, I now have a condition. Okay? Because I'm sick. And you also said that I have a condition and that I'm the most difficult of all the men you've ever seen. Okay, so now, what will you eat? Since you will not eat or touch anything that I bought with the money Mr. Ajoku gave me, of which I told you myself, oh, I told you, if I didn't tell you, you would not have known. Don't call him Mr. Because he has no qualification to be called Mr. How can you call an Aboro, Aboro to bad boy Mr.? What are you going to eat? Do you have some money that you can give to me so I, I can go and make you another plate of food and also buy you some toiletries? Eh? I, I even deposited some of the money with the cashier outside. 
I don't know now. Maybe we will we'll tell them to also throw that money away. Uh, then maybe you have some money that you give to me so I can also pay them. I'm gonna laugh at them. Keep laughing at me. Now I am sick. Eh? And men are chasing you left, right, and center. And you're happy. And so you're rejoicing over my condition, isn't it? Laugh at me, Agona. Laugh at me. I'm not to go home. I'll come back with you in a better mood. But don't, don't forget to tell the nurses to come and clean up this mess. They never come here and clean up this mess. Don't you think you're being too hard on your wife? Shut up. Shut up, my friend. You think this is this, this is a police case? Huh? Is that what you think? Your duty here is to guard me. You know the shape, self. Look at his face. If you talk to me anyhow now, I'll, I'll, what I'll do to you, you. Wait, wait, my friend. What would you do? I'm asking you, what would you do? Now listen, let me tell you something. A man who is down fears no fall. Okay? I don't fear any fall. Your bag now. My brother's wife. Don't I have clothes, shoes, handbags, cream, even pants and bra in this house? Do I need to carry a bag all the way from the boarding house back to this village? Eh? <laughs> and my brother's wife, any one I do not have. I will use my own, I know. <laughs> Welcome. I hope what I am hearing is not true. That my brother shot Nandi for bringing his dirty, stupid, smelling manhood near you. And the police arrested him and chained him in the hospital. Eh? Yeah. You could be you're just coming back. Uh, it's a long story. Let's go inside first. You have not paid me off. Hey, you shut your mouth. Hey, tell me, true or false, that my brother is chained by the police in the hospital as a result of him firing Nnamdi with bullets. True or false? Answer me. I want to see is your daughter. The person you teamed up with to beat up my brother because he came here to defend his inter 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 integrity. Eh? Okay. Momo is in the toilet. Wait, let me, let, let me go and call her. Momo! 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 Maureen! She look at me! Hey! Maureen!
change like that. There will be something you or I can do about it. Hey? The, the worst is that after he has been through all this, they will still take him to court and charge him for, for shooting a Namdi. <sighs> I'm praying. That is all that is left to do. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Me, I'm praying too. I'm praying and there's something I can do. Hey, God, yeah. What is it you're planning again? Eh? You know that your brother will frown at any rash actions that you take. You have to be very careful. What, what are you going to do again this time? Me, I do not care about what my brother frowns at. I care about his freedom. I'm going out. I might belong. I might not belong. If you don't hear from me all through today, don't worry. I'll be fine. Eh? Sleep, eat, relax. Don't worry too much. I'm coming. Don't worry. Because you are not dying, I'm going, don't worry. Your brother can do worse than that as long as you settle me. Eh? <laughs> Do you want them to see both of us? Don't you know that any decision you take concerning this matter, they'll say it's because I said so. Uh, well, you know, I don't bloody care. I don't. Because the, your brother was right. The man was molesting his wife. Listen, what gave that man the right to molest another person's wife? What? Come, let me go drop uh, you off, Jai. I calm down now. What is it? Just go, I'll be fine. Don't forget, I've not said so then. I've not paid the hotel. No, that, that... Just go, just go. God damn! Sorry! Ow! receive any favor from any man without paying with your body. And it has been as I said. No one messes with the NRA. Mess and pay. That's my name. <laughs> and that's it was <laughs> As for your brother John, <laughs> his trouble will never end. I am the unforgiving one. Until Mwandeze comes back to me. Only then will I bring my sword down. I get bad. Beside that. Hey, hey. Hey. We are progressing. Hey, hey. 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 Hey, Yes, sir. Um, sir, did you did you say I should take off the cuffs on Mr. John? Okay, sir. I heard you, sir. Sean, sir. Right away, sir. Right away, sir. Did 
did you sleep with the DPO? Because I know you. Did you sleep with him to have him order that you remove this hand off? Tell me the truth. But that, that one is not important now. Hey! Hellfire! Hellfire! You could hear you a disgrace. You are a disgrace to this family and you are a disgrace to womanhood. Officer! Can I put my hand this 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 hand off? Can I put this hand off back? Mother, uh. what is the meaning of this now? Eh? I don't I don't like it all. I, I don't like this kind of thing. You should be happy that you, you're, you're free from this hand off. Eh? I, I, and you're shouting. I, I don't like it all. I, I don't want this kind of freedom. I don't want. Can I put it? Come 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 come. Put this 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 hand off back. Hey, if I tell me I'm going, nah, I'm going. Uh. Come on, get away from here. Get away from here. Who is bloody civilian? Stop shouting here! Stop shouting! Stop shouting! Stop shouting! I will shout! I will shout! What would you do if I shout? What would you do? I want to advise you. Please I want to advise you to drop this case. Do not move on. Do not move on with this case any further. You are villagers. You are villagers. Do not move on with this case. Do not move on with this case any further. You are villagers. You do not know the tenets of a court of law or the prescriptions of the constitution. The crime committed by John in shooting him is just an act of provocation. And if you go to court, you will lose the case. But how, sir? Simple. Your brother wanted to rape his wife, and he shot the potential rapist of his wife. His wife is still alive, and he can bear witness to this. Finish. If you go to talk in court, the magistrate will throw two of you into prison. And you people gathered that day and gave him mob, mob action in the day of the incident. He can identify the two of you and can also press charges in a law court. Then two of you will go into prison. Prison? prison. No, no, I'm sorry, sir. Prison. Take my advice, please. I took it. Once he is released from the hospital, let him go home. There is no need to make trouble. Let him go home and rest. There is no need to make trouble. You're not eating. Eat what? With what appetite? Look, Arona, it's exactly three days now since I was discharged from the hospital. Eh? It's only three days now. Listen, Arona, the pastor has tried. You have tried. I have tried. Everybody else has tried. Eh? I'm thinking it's time we we'll try something else. Something else like what? I'm thinking we should try another native healer. Again? Again? John, do you ever learn your lessons? What do I do now? I'm the, I'm the one that is sick. Eh? And I need solutions. So if they tell you that the devil has a solution to your problem, you will go to him, John. I will go. I will go as it is now, Will. May God have mercy on your soul. God, please have mercy on me. Have mercy on my soul. Hmm. You will die. What? Never. My God forbid. You see what I told you? You see what I told you? I said, let's not bring this man into this house, but you will not hear me. Eh? Hey! Hey! Here, my Kwambu Jesus. I'm a Kwamunka. They are holding him somewhere. Mm -hmm. Unless something is done, he will lie down like this until the day he dies. Never. Back to sender. But there is something that we can do. Please. Only oh, yeah. Tell me. Hmm. Tell me.
tell your wife to excuse us. Eh? You see? You better say what you have to say here. Yeah, now. I'm not going anywhere. I'm sitting by my husband. Some things are not for women. The spirits cannot commune in this kind of matter mm -hmm. with a woman present. It's a manly talk. Spirit squad. will take her and the spell over you shall be broken. Nothing will happen to you. You will not die. Instead, you will prosper and have money beyond your widest imagination. No, Uri, no. Not my wife. Not my wife, Uri. Can I sacrifice myself? I can give myself as a living sacrifice to you to do as you like with it. Please. And in exchange, give my family a better life. Uri, look at me now. Look at me. Of what use am I to that woman? He's the one struggling for the family now. Uh -huh. He's the one struggling for the family. Oh, you take my soul. Do with it whatever you want to do. At the next change, grant her favor. Favor of form upon favor in this world, please. It can be done. It can be done. But do not mention this, our discussion, to anybody. If your wife asks you what we discuss, tell her that I asked you to allow me to take your sight so that I can make you blind in exchange for your walking. Tell her you refused. Hmm? When will the sacrifice be? There is no need for delay. Break yourself. Break yourself and bring out blood. When you bring out your blood, I shall use it for sacrifice. And henceforth, when you see marks on your body, you know that I'm the one taking your blood for sacrifice. Or when you hear them knocking on your head, as if they are playing drums or knocking on your head. Know that I have one or two clients who want one or two things attended to. And I am taking the raw materials from your body. You will henceforth belong to me to use whenever I like. Do you accept this? Think before you answer me. Oria, oh, yeah. I have been bedridden for almost a year now. Nothing has saved me. If you use me as a baby sacrifice, at least I'll be useful to my family. But if my answer is, yes, use me. There's no need for delay. Use this to prick your body so that we can use it. Prick yourself. <clears throat> Never! Never! I shall fight you, boy. He is mine! You cannot use my team for your sacrifice. I don't think you about it. He's already mine. You cannot use a condemned animal 
for your sacrifice. John. John. You think you are smart? You will suffer. Suffer. And die. He wants you to live so that he can use you for his work. And again, I hate him. <laughs> hey, oh God, where Oh God, where We We shall see who will win the battle. Nonsense. Madam, you will see how that win. Hey! Hey! Oh God, where we are we? Go anywhere! Nkwa? Eke? Oh yeah. The last day of the market. Who was it? The boy. Was I the pam pam pam? Was I the gugro? Who said it? Oh God, we will. We will move, we will dig it. We will move, we will dig it. We will move, we will dig it. I sing the forty year kai ho. We will move, we will dig it. He may move, we will dig it. We will move, we will dig it. I sing the forty year kai ho. Put on, put on. Ego kana chokwa nu ego kana chokwa nu chaba ego mebe ego nu ego dia fella dig a fella man and the money we take one ego no for your chop what you seek is money but it will require blood sacrifice human blood great one is that possible where can we find human blood that is not a problem i can find it and i can get it but it will cost you some money it will cost you one million naira each. That is three million naira for three of you. Great one. We need to walk. Well, if that is what it will take, I, I, I think we are willing. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yes, we are. That is no problem. I shall go on a quest in the spirit, and I shall find the blood. And when I find the blood, I shall get it, so that your sacrifice can be complete, and you shall have wealth beyond your imagination. For even as I speak to you, there are people who have pledged themselves to me as raw material for my sacrifice and in exchange for the well-being of their families. So the great Ori can provide human blood. I shall not hunt. I shall not kill. I shall not cut human heads. But I shall produce and provide human blood. <laughs> do you believe I can do this? Yes, 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 great one. Yes, Then there is no problem. At this same place where the promise was made to bring the money and the blood, there we shall complete the sacrifice. Huh? John, I call you! I call you from the spirit realm to come, come to the great temple of Ori. <laughs> Nadia, Nadia, I can see you. <laughs> Welcome to my temple. It is time for the sacrifice. <laughs> ah, easy, easy, uh, easy. Mm. Uh, 
Whenever I need blood, I will hurry and take the blood before she calls that name. Or... Okay, maybe I will take the blood before... Or else when she's not around. you are doing by your attire you look like one of my kind what brings you to my house showing so much anger I'm the great Enere oh Enere I've heard about you my friends stay away from John I have condemned you to death John The same John? No. John is my sacrifice. He has pledged himself to me as my sacrifice. He will continue to serve my purpose. He is to die. I condemn him to suffer for one year and die in pain. No, 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 no. That was before. He cannot die now. John will live. He will live to supply raw material for my sacrifices. Or, how do you expect me to have human blood for my sacrifices? Do you expect me to kill every time I want blood? The gods forbid. You can't kill John now. He will live. I said John will die. He will live. I said John will die. I said John will live. My friend, how dare you challenge me when I'm talking, you are talking. John must die. Oria says John will die. Go out there you. How dare you <sighs> when I'm talking? Mm. I cannot be pitched in battle over John with you. The great Oria. Eh? You stop. Take what I'm talking Who are you? I'm not going to talk to you. Oh yeah. Wait for me. 
I will be back. We can do it now. I am ever ready. If you come, you die. I'll pin you. Ena. Can I hear you again? You pin who? I said I will pin you. Pin you. Ena. It's a white guy. And die. Come, come back and die. Let me go and prepare for you. <laughs> I am always prepared. Ever ready. I am. I am. Oh, never gonna have a canoe. More than more than one. Oh, never gonna have a canoe. Here. Here. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, John, I want you to tell me the truth. The whole truth. Exactly what is going on. Lots of strange things are just happening here and there. Left, right, and center. Just this afternoon, suddenly you started screaming that uh, somebody was walking you from side to side. Who was walking you? Exactly what is going on. I have nothing to tell. Oh. I just know it is an attack. A spiritual attack from enemies. Enemies what? Do, do we have enemies? I have no idea. We have oh. We have. Like that native doctor that was trying to kill me. Uh -huh. Exactly, does that man have against you? I don't know. I don't know. I do not even know the man. Just like that. Hmm. Somebody just becomes somebody's enemy. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> 